Tell us about when you first had that dream to be a singer. Well, I dreamed that I was singing in front of thousands of people. I was young. And I always tell people, it wasn't that I wanted to be famous. Mm -hmm. I didn't care nothing about the fame. Mm -hmm. I can't stand the fame. Mm -hmm. still, I, it's, you, you guys know what comes with all yes. of that. Mm -hmm. But what I do love is when I open my mouth, and even now to this day, I see people change, I see change breaking. Wave at the neighbors. Hi. We on the way. <laughs> <laughs> We're here in your old stomping ground. No, this is so, like, I'm so excited and just, it just means a lot to me because coming back here and being in my old hometown that, you know, lived here for 30 years. It's so beautiful. I know. And actually, you know, Fantasia House that she purchased for her mom is right across the street from where we purchased our first home uh, here in Charlotte. So soon thereafter her winning American Idol, she did that. That was like one of her first, you know, acts of kindness to her mom and Bobby, family. One of her dreams that she had and finally it came true. Mm -hmm. And getting to interview her, who we considered 20 years ago, our, you know, our hometown um, star. And yes, being yes, so yes. proud out of her when she won American Idol and just I just remember in my living room just cheering her on and being like she's saying that daggone <laughs> <laughs> you know it so, doesn't seem like it was that long ago but it has it, been a few years oh my goodness it doesn't yeah. time flies by I've only been watching both of them from far off mm -hmm. so to be up close and personal and hear their stories about the journey yeah that they've experienced I'm, I'm happy about being able to hear that I can remember you know, being in Charlotte and her being, you know, a hometown star here, you know, she was big news. So there was, you know, a lot of the great things, but there were also some of the more challenging experiences that she went through and her whole family went through that was public, you know? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, and, you know, Charlotte's a big town, but it's a small town too, and small town mentality. And just curious to just hear her story, like you say, the truth, uh -huh. give them a chance, and especially her mom, to tell their story. 